Hi friends! Um, I'm on the floor because we have a project and we had my grandson's hands, Jackson, and we are making uh, Christmas gifts. So I just wanted to film this part and I thought, well, I'm not going to run downstairs with all the stuff. So we made handprints and he was scream. Oop, where are you? We made handprints and he was not happy about it. So we, yeah, didn't want to film that part. Because you guys would have been like, yeah, nice kid. <laughs> Anyways, so I'm going to make, show you guys how, I'm going to turn this, how to make little Christmas gifts with these dollar store bulbs or any kind of bulbs that you can get. These ones and um, make a little snowman and the year of your grandchild, child or whatever. So what we're going to do, we've got Tosca pens. And I'm just going to make little carrot nose. Do you see that? I don't know if I'm holding it right. I'm going to need, Charity, I'm going to need your help with my guidance of if I'm in, in here while I'm drawing. So here's my carrot nose. And another one. This little guy right here. I don't know if you guys can see that. I'm hoping that it's hard to kind of know where I'm at and draw and look at this. And this little one here, this thumb can be one, two. And there we go. Got to use the Posca pen. We do the eyeballs. You could do the scarfs. You could do a chook. And then you do the buttons all the way down. So you just kind of wiggle around with eyes because you need the little coal eyes. And close the bathroom door, please. Jackson's now having a bath. And wiggle some eyes on. So this is a neat, easy idea of having a little cute Christmas gift that you can send off to family. And it's everyone gets one. It's kind of cute. I'm hoping I'm in here. It is so hard to do this when it's not like in one spot over my craft table it's really hard to know where I'm at so that is the snowman so whoa and now we decide on the chook you could do multicolor chooks and the Pasca pans are really great for this I'm using um, deco art uh, multi satin because it's got a bit of a sheen then I just spray a little bit of a gloss finish to, to seal it in so then the paint stays on better and that's about it that's all you do what color chooks do you want share Green too? Blue. Blue. We have blue okay, so we're going to do, I'm just grabbing my Posca pan here. We're going to do blue. I don't think this one started, but it's not going to take much. To... Ah, sorry guys, I'm totally going crazy in where I'm at. So I got light blue and dark blue. Yeah. I'm gonna... Whoa! Sorry guys, this is really hard to hold up. So here it is. So I'm going to do like a kind of little stripey here. And just kind of do it like a beanie. There's a beanie toque type of thing almost. And then I'm going to do a pom-pom. You can do little stripes or whatever. And I'm going to do a darker blue pom-pom. So these are some blue toques. You can do multi-different colors. Um, some of the... That one, I didn't put his eyes on yet. There's another toque. I know if you guys... I'm sorry, it's so hard to know where I'm at okay right here now I'm gonna grab the blue the dark blue Carefully. do a little star thing for the pom-pom can you see that guys I'm so sorry I'm just kind of gonna kind of like do that for all of them And that's basically it. You guys can outline it in blue or whatever. So, there I know. There's just so much glare. Maybe the kitchen lights so. out. But that's about it. That's nice. And you can do red. You can do pink for girls. You can do um, the family members. So mom and, you know, orange, little dog, whatever you guys want for family or anything like that. So that is my idea. Well, it's actually an idea that's been out there forever. Uh, my one of my girls had it for when they're, they're in kindergarten. She's like, what, 16 now, 15? So, yeah. 
but it's so cute and easy to do. And if the child doesn't want to agree with you, you're just going to hold their hand in your palm. So then their hand's there and you just roll the ball in it. And it's pretty easy enough. You're holding their wrists, so it's pretty easy to make them give you a print, even if they're screaming. So then we can do scarves or whatever. So I did a little practice snowman on the white page to see, ah, to see what would look good for like a scarf. So that's what you do, just kind of play with it. Now I have some, my Posca pen here. And my little, everybody's making noise. It's not a good day for the baby. So what I do is I'm just going to kind of make a little wave. And just fill in the spots like that for their scarf. I forgot. I forgot the little mouth. So I'm going to do a little mouth. Just some spots for the mouth. You guys can see this? Just a little smiley face. And an upset baby in the other room. There we go, guys. Bye, guys. Thanks for watching.